this project is about seeing if it's biologically, economically, environmentally feasible to produce uh, biopolymers in the leaves of poplar trees while, they're gro while we're growing them for energy and wood products. So it would be a co-product. What's really nice about it is it's a collaboration with Gunti Murdy over in bioengineering so we can model, we can learn how to extract it and we can begin to do modeling to say, does it make environmental sense? Are there real carbon benefits? Can it be economically feasible? Uh, collaborators are Greenwood Resources, which is a company based in Portland, Oregon that grows poplars intensively and is advising us on the analysis and helping guide us to do uh, modeling that really makes uh, real world sense. Uh, the best funding was critical to provide matching funds required by the granting program, the Sun Grant, uh, that allowed us to the work to go forward. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to create a replacement for fossil fuel derived plastics. One that would be renewable, have no net carbon impacts, not put carbon into the atmosphere to help slow down global warming. And because it's a natural kind of plastic produced from natural bacterial plastics based on them, it will be uh, biodegradable in the environment much more rapidly than fossil fuel produced plastics are.